All right, this is gonna be a quick video on the wheel speed sensor. Um, got the jack in there. That's the Harbor Freight three ton low profile long reach jack. That's an excellent jack. Um, love this jack. All right, so you can see we got the mix sig set up. We're gonna be looking at an AC sine wave from the speed sensor. I got channel one on over here. Up there to the speed sensor, you can see where the red and black wires are. So we've got, um, yeah, we've got the ground wire connected on one side of the sensor and we have the signal wire connected on the other side of the sensor. And now, as we spin our wheel, we should see an AC sine wave. Um, just to show how this works, here is a mix sig setup. If you go to sensors, road speed sensor, it tells you to please connect channel one with the BNC. Um, Please excuse my speech. I know it's kind of hard to understand me. I just had oral surgery done. Um, part of my mouth is still numb. And anyway, so here we go. We'll hit OK. And this is how it sets us up. It sets us up our amplitude at two volts per division, 10 milliseconds on our time base, showing us BNC, low pass filter, DC. I don't know why it's showing DC. Um, I'm gonna set this up my way. I'm gonna also go BNC, low pass. I'm gonna go AC. I'm gonna get rid of the cursors for right now. Move this up here to the middle. And we'll spin the wheel and we should see an AC sine wave. Oh yeah. Um, We'll go. Oh, look at that. All right, well, somehow I lost some recording. Um, it was just me showing you on all data at five miles per hour, we want to be about 650 millivolts. So I set one cursor up right here at zero. And Y2, the upper cursor, is set right at 652. Um, so right about there is about 5 miles per hour. And that's right where we want to be. We want to be right at 650. There's nothing wrong with this truck. I'm just using it to make a video because I don't recall ever making a video with the speed sensor with the mix sig and I don't think anybody else has either. Also, what I didn't get recorded is right now, if you notice up on the top, we have a counter here because I turned the recorder on. So it's taking a video. We can hit stop recording. Do you want to stop? Okay. And then we can go here to home. We can go to movies. Not sure which one would be which here. Okay. Yeah, so this is it right here. Um, hit play. There it is. All right, guys, that's another one down with the Mixig SATO 1004. That's Mixig's new next gen automotive scope. Really digging it, really liking it. It's a pretty awesome scope. If you want to see more about it, check out my channel. I got other a few other videos with it. I've got videos of the previous one as well as one of their other scopes. And I'll have more coming with this one. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. And we'll check you all out next time. Thanks for stopping by.